Millions of people have gotten a kick out of my next guest in such films as uh, <laughs> Bloodsport, Cyborg, Kickboxer. Uh, he has a new movie called Lionheart. Let's bring him on, Jean-Claude Van Damme. Close, man, you you were like your foot was. I saw like the the busted brown lay of the what. I, your foot was right there. It's okay, I'm insured. Okay, yeah, but I'm worried about this nose job. I got. Okay, <laughs> just a joke. Um, <laughs> it took me one year to be on your show. One year? Yeah. You were trying to get on the show? Oh, absolutely. Oh man, well I'm glad the you're here. Best here. show in the country. Yeah. yeah. They're mad at me now. No, no. <laughs> Every busy has got a waiting list. No, I, I'm, I'm glad you are finally here, and uh, we can talk about this new mo movie. But first, where are you from? Belgium. Muscles from Brussels. I Woo! heard that. <laughs> <laughs> Muscles from Brussels. How did you get into the martial arts thing? Oh, I started uh, karate when I was nine years old, a baby. Yeah. Because I was very skinny, small. Well, as a baby. So, as a baby. Yeah. yeah. Nine years old. <laughs> And then I came to karate and um, took me years to build myself and uh, it really helped me to build myself and uh, helped me to achieve my dream in the USA to become an actor. Now did you, uh, did, you uh, did you get into martial arts because you wanted to one day do movies? Oh since years ago I mean I was always dreaming about movie mm -hmm. then when you have a when you have a nine years old who come to you and your daddy mm -hmm. hey daddy I want to be a movie star mm -hmm. you're gonna tell him Go back to your study, you know, because Belgium is like a, a village comparing uh, the USA, and I'm, I'm the first Belgium guy who made it. Yeah, of all your movies, what's your favorite? I've got many movies. I've got uh, On the Waterfront. Stop bragging, man. On the Waterfront. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, but of yours, of the ones you've done. Oh, my movies? Yes. Uh, Lionheart. <laughs> you've been briefed very well, haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> and the next one, Double Impact. Double Impact is next? I'm playing twin. Oh. Imagine two Arsenio, a very playboy guy and a macho guy, fighting each other. Whoa. And you play both of them? Yeah. Double salary. Yeah. <laughs> mm. <laughs> yes, yes, okay. Um, how's your wife? Your, your wife is a bodybuilder, right? Why you ask? Oh, I just uh, like to inform them uh, about my guest. Uh, this guy's a big playboy. No, 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 no. Don't tell them that because they'll believe it. He's a priest. Yes, yes. <laughs> Bless you, Van Damme. Uh, <laughs> no, she's also an athlete. Yeah, and she's uh, Puerto Rican. Mm -hmm. And uh, I've got two. <laughs> I've got two babies, a boy and a girl. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Somebody's happy that you have children. <laughs> so, um, when when you're doing these martial arts movies, yeah, um, do you get that close when you kick? How do you, how do you make them look real? By uh, touching the guy. You actually touch him sometimes? No, no, no. Because you know, De Niro got his nose broken in 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 his latest film. I'm, I'm, there must be accidents on your film. That's not my fault. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, when we when we're kicking, sometimes it happened. The guys get get very excited and he come too close and uh, it can happen but very rarely you ever do that and hurt somebody really bad no, no. only in uh, competition before yeah you don't compete anymore no no I finished I, I stopped fighting when I was 21 yeah I was a baby <laughs> you like that word baby yeah like, how long have you been speaking English uh, when I came in this country, I was 20 years old, 20, 21 years old, and uh, I came in, in, in the USA, in Los Angeles, with few words in my mouth. Uh, yes, no, how are you? Mm -hmm. Can you drive me? And that's it. Yeah. <laughs> it's true. You gotta be careful with can you drive me here in LA. <laughs> it's so bad. 
back. <laughs> let's see. Let's look at I a love piece. Of... This <laughs> <laughs> let's look at a piece of Lionheart. Yeah. What, what are you doing? This probably fight. Let's see it, Sandy. We don't have to set it up. Go. I step out. Take your time now. Don't be shaking hands with him. Don't shake hands. Come on, not come on. Not with Looks very dangerous. I mean, I, I don't know. Uh, who would win if you and Steven Seagal had a fight? <laughs> Below or above the belt? Oh, now, now explain that. Now, <laughs> it's very easy. Uh, I, I don't know. Uh, above the belt. Above the belt? <laughs> yes. Of course, me. Now, if I had to say below the belt, what would you have answered? Of course, me. <laughs> He's a, he's a wonderful guy. He's doing. I think Steven Seagal and myself, we're both different, and uh, we are, I believe, the new action star. And mm -hmm. he's a wonderful guy. Yeah. yeah. You ever work out with him or, or meet him even? No. I'd no. like to see you all in a movie together. Yeah? yeah. Who's going to play the bad guy? Uh, you can both be good guys and beat up bad guys. Yeah, like you and uh, Eddie Murphy. Yeah, yeah, we'll yeah. be the bad guys, and you guys can be the good guys. <laughs> Steven Seagal. That'd be good. But, uh. <laughs> but see. <laughs> Steven Seagal, myself against Eddie Murphy and our senior. Yeah, and I, I'll tell you, now, see, see y'all, but y'all, see y'all will be doing. Yeah, you know, Steven will be doing that 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 walk he does, you know, you know, and 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 you will be doing your thing, no, I'll, and we'll I'll be, be. I'll be doing this. Oh. Oh. Ah. 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 But we would win. We would win, cause while you're down there, I would push you. Then I throw some dirt in your eyes. <laughs> and karate that! Mm. <laughs> Thanks for coming. Lionheart, John Claude Van Damme. We'll be right back. with uh, Schwarzenegger. Once. Yes, yes. I was in the outfit of the, uh, wait my English, Predator. Predator? Right. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that, that was fun. Now, now, who would win if you and Schwarzenegger squared off? <sighs> him. <laughs> just go on and say it, him. He'd just take one of them pecs, pop you and be <laughs> over, you know. Okay, he'll win. <laughs> Is he a nice guy to work with? Wonderful guy. Wonderful guy, very, very strong mentally and very nice with the crew people. Yeah. Smart guy. Yeah, in other countries, uh, are you also a big Below star? Below or above the belt? <laughs> Below the belt in other countries. No, are you um, a big star around the world? Because I know action movies seem to transcend languages. And are your American movies? You know what's nice about action? Uh, comedy, we have different type of humor mm -hmm. in Europe and yeah. Asia, USA. But everybody, everybody understand a punch in the face. So. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm very big in Europe, uh -huh. and uh, I'm going to become, I hope so, very big in the U.S. Yeah. Are your parents back there still? No, I brought all my family in the USA. It was my dream. I bought them a house and... Uh, yeah. You know, I, I was calling my father for years, and we didn't talk too much because he think I was doing crazy stuff. Uh, like, like what? You know, I was, I own a gym in Europe, a big uh -huh. gymnasium, and I left and I closed everything down. I was making a lot of money, but I want to make it so much. So I love, I, I left, I left Belgium and I, I came here for, for many years. And then finally I brought my father and he saw a brand new house and I told him, Daddy, pick any room you want. It's yours. Oh, wow. That's cool. That was cool. I noticed, I've been watching you like since you've been in the studio. You do this to people a lot. Where does that come from? Oh, from Thailand. Somebody kept. It's a uh, big thank you. Oh, okay. Gotcha. What is, what is actually your style of martial arts? Um, 
you've got so many different styles. Um, you know, it's like religion. Mm -hmm. It's a new style, it's a new outfit, new license, mm -hmm. new money. But a kick is a kick and a punch is a punch. So, so you, don't, you don't believe in, well, Aikido is my thing. You know, you just... I believe in training. The guy who goes in the gym every morning at 5 a.m., who sweat a lot, who train, who run, it's going to be in good shape. And I think you have to adapt a style to your own anatomy. Example, you're very tall and mm -hmm. very long arms, long mm -hmm. feet, so mm -hmm. you, you'll, be, you'll be fighting with distance. Yeah. A guy like Tyson with very sh short hand is going to come very close to you and go mm -hmm. for the knockout. So we have different styles, like Muhammad Ali, he's jumping, dancing, beautiful, and mm -hmm. Tyson is fighting close. Yeah. Different styles, you know? Okay, so when you first started studying, what, would you, what were you into? Uh, traditional Shotokan. Karate. It's very traditional. You've got to control your touch, your kick, and everything. Mm -hmm. And then I became very professional, and uh, I adapt a style to my own anatomy. Yeah. Now, um, does your love for bugs have anything to do with martial arts? My what? I, th I heard you loved bugs. Oh, bugs. I respect bugs. Ah, ah, okay. <laughs> so that's a different question. Let's talk about your respect for bugs. No, because they're very... <clears throat> bugs are very strong. They're very strong. All life, they're working so hard and they, very, they, they succeed to their mission. When I came in this country, you always have to think, if you have two feet and two hands, everything is possible. You've got to make it. If a guy from Belgium made it, an American guy can make it, no problem. And bugs are strong. You know what, though? It, it sounded funny when you first started talking about bugs. When you think about it, I've seen like an ant with a huge piece of bread going across the right. room, you know? It'd be like a piece of bread, little tiny, it'd be like, you know? So, you know, the study of bugs, that there's something there. Huh? Yeah, they're very strong. <laughs> <laughs> sexually um, also. Sexually? They're very strong sexually. All day, all night, non-stop. How do you know these things? Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, when, <laughs> when you were, <laughs> when you, uh, 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 <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no, no more this, huh? Yeah. You're doing this now. No, okay? no, yes, yes, forget that, forget meow, meow, from now on, coming from here. Yeah. <laughs> when you first, uh, tried to support yourself here as you were making it, or beginning to make it, uh, what kind of jobs did you do? Uh, everything. I was illegal in the country. So I did pizzas, laying carpet. What was the first one? Driving a pizza. Oh, yeah, Delivery. Domino's. Domino's. Half hour, you give it to me free. No, I won't. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite. <laughs> and you take the money, you know. I was eating everything. I was so starving. I was eating and the guy opened. That's it? I don't know. <laughs> so, no, and then um, <laughs> I, was, I, was, I was driving taxis. Uh -huh. Limousine, yeah. for people like you, good tips, <laughs> everything. <laughs> well, good luck with this new movie, Thanks. man. And stop by again. I'm sorry it took you so long to get here because I'm a fan of your movies. Thank you, man. And, uh, Thank you. I'll see you soon on the next one. Thank you. Jean-Claude Van Damme, no, no.